seen. I'm Anastasia Crockett. Got all allergies? Don't get sick often? You could be a nethrodrol. Nethrodrol. We've got the details. And I'm Audrey Troughton. What happens to Space Jam? It falls to Earth in Vietnam. Your CSN News starts now. Juniors or seniors, if you want to take the February ACT test, you need to register online today. Go to www.actstudent.org to register. Hey seniors, do you have a 3.5 GPA and are you planning to attend CWA next year? See Mrs. Kimball ASAP to sign up for Scholars Day and have an opportunity to earn exclusive scholarships. 21st Century Club will start up for the second semester on Monday after school until 5.45 p.m. If you have any questions, please contact Mr. Hill, Mr. Riley, or Ms. Strickler. Attention all students and staff. NNU is offering free admission to the Crusader basketball game on Thursday, January 21st. The game starts at 7 o'clock p.m. and its parking is free. Come out and support your local college. Our Wild Pride dance team is performing in Pocotello this weekend. Good luck, ladies. Ping Pong Club will meet after school on Monday and Tuesday each week. Come either day to play. Any student can still join. Also, there will be a ping pong tournament Thursday the 21st after school. Come and show off your mad ping pong skills. We'll be right back after this. Drivers, remember, winter driving is not just a snow day. You need to be prepared for the worst. Here are a few tips to help you stay safe. Remember to allow extra stopping distance in between cars. Pack emergency supplies like a blanket, water, and flares. Always keep traction sand in case you get stuck in the snow. With these tips in mind, you can stay safe this winter. Brought to you by Dr. Kim Keller. Your smile is your first impression. Make it a good one and visit Dr. Keller today. Today's high Oh no, yeah, today's high is a 30 with low 23. Tomorrow we're going to have a high 43 with a low 33. It's going to be partly, no, it's going to be cloudy on Monday and partly cloudy on Tuesday. On Wednesday and Thursday we're going to have um, temperatures in the range of 35 and temperatures in the low of 25. And it's going to be cloudy on Wednesday and sunny on Thursday. Back to you, Audrey. About 2% of the DNA in most people alive today came from trysts between ancient humans and their Neanderthal neighbors tens of thousands of years ago, recent studies have shown. Now, scientists are trying to determine what, if any, impact that the Neanderthal gen genetic legacy has on our contemporary lives. In a pair of papers published this week in the American Journal of Human Genetics, two research teams report that in many people, a group of genes that govern the first line of defense against disease was most likely inherited from Neanderthals. These same genes appear to play a role in some people's allergic reaction to things like pollen and pet fur, as well as scientists said. Vietnam's military is investigating the appearance of three mysterious metal balls, believed to be debris from space, which landed in countries remote north, a senior army official said Friday. Two metal balls were discovered in northwestern Yinbe province on January 2nd. Later, a larger ball weighing some 45 kilograms, which is 100 pounds, landed in a maize field in the neighboring province. Pro 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 we are still identifying where they came from, officials said, adding the army had to determine they could, they, that, that, that they did not contain explosives or hazardous material. The metal balls fell from the sky, he said, scaring local residents. Today's SAT word of the day is bogus, which means Sham, not genuine. Counterfeit. You could use it this way. Miners claim that the gold in the mountains above were false, causing locals to name the area Bogus Basin. Thanks for watching, and remember, live the Wildcat way! way.